Hello and welcome to Mashable's Air Friday, where we air fry anything and everything in the name of deliciousness. I am culture reporter Tim Marson, and this week we are air frying twisted bacon. Now I bet you're wondering, what is twisted bacon? Is it some kind of like evil Halloween bacon? No, it's bacon that's twisted um, and apparently is a very good snack. And the recipe is incredibly simple. Uh, You take a piece of bacon and you twist it and then you air fry it. This comes from uh, TikTok actually, like pretty much every other air fryer recipe. And it's from Jackie Hartlob, AKA low carb state of mind, one of the queens of air frying. You've probably seen her videos. So I'm just copying what she did in that where she literally took a piece of bacon, stretched it out, and just kind of gave it a twist. And what I'm trying to do here, as she did in the TikTok video, is put them close to one another so they don't unravel during the cooking process. Um, I'm not sure what the utility of twisted bacon is. I'm not sure uh, why we would do this, just add a step instead of just making bacon. Something that's a little strange about this is the twisted bacon is supposed to cook for 40, four zero minutes at 275 degrees. That is a comically long time to cook bacon. It's cooking at a really low temperature. I still think it might get burnt, but who knows? Um, So this is not one of those air fryer recipes that is saving you time and energy. You are adding energy by twisting the bacon and you are taking way more time than it would normally take to cook some strips of bacon. But we're gonna try it anyway in the name of science because maybe something magical happens when you twist it up. Um, So what I'm gonna do is just finish twisting that up and then we're gonna get it in the air fryer. Twisted strips of bacon. Now the video on TikTok from Low Carb State of Mind says you can season it a little bit if you want. Um, I'm just gonna do pepper. I'm not gonna do salt on this because it is cured bacon, which is already pretty inherently salty. So we're just gonna do a little bit of pepper, maybe just to counteract that saltiness. And then again, we're gonna take these twisted strips of bacon and we're gonna put them in the air fryer at 275 degrees for 40 minutes. Uh, Hopefully it's worth it. So I'm gonna go ahead and get that going and then check back in later. So I'm gonna pull them out, take a look, and I'm gonna drain them on a plate with a paper towel. So we just have twisted up little bacon rolls. Um, I'm gonna put them on here to drain any extra uh, grease we still have on them. Let them sit there. They're clearly very cooked through. Um, Kinda hard. Now the smart thing to do would be to let this sit for a second, but I'm gonna try this twisted up bacon while it is extremely hot. It's bacon, it tastes great. It's hard to make bacon bad. Uh, But again, this took 40 minutes and I had to sit there and twist it up for no real apparent reason. Um, It did render a lot of the fat off, but otherwise I don't really see the utility in spending 40 minutes to make bacon when you can make it even in the air fryer at about 10 if you just go a higher temperature and don't twist it up. Um, If you want it for the novelty, sure, knock yourself out. But uh, otherwise, I recommend just making regular old bacon. But you do with your time whatever you want. 